You've sacrificed so much for me. The love of your family. I hope and pray my leaving opens the door for reconciliation between you and your children, Martin. And you and your wife. Stay in harmony, Martin. Become the husband and father you would have continued to be had I not interrupted your life. I confess, this isn't the only reason I'm going. My presence has caused deep friction between Sheridan and Louise. Once I'm gone, they'll have a much better chance for the future they deserve. No. I can't even tell you how sorry I am to hurt you and Sheridan. I just pray you understand I only want good things to come from my leaving. I love you, my darling. I always will. Catherine. Who's that? What are you doing out here? You can't block this jet's takeoff. Where the hell we can't? My sister's baby's on this plane. Look, a psychotic woman has kidnapped my daughter. We have to get on that plane. You've got the wrong plane, lady. This is an emergency flight carrying medical equipment. No passengers, only crew. No, no that, that can't Wait, be. What are you talking about? The crane jet, it can carry up to 16 passengers. But that may be, but this isn't the crane jet. Same model, but an entirely different aircraft. That plane isn't even kept at this airfield anymore. Well, then where the hell is the crane jet? Across town at the corporate airport, out on Route 110. Oh, my God. No. I demand to know why my plane has been denied permission to take off. I'm sorry, Mr. Crane, but... But nothing! I want that plane in the air now. You just calm down just a moment. Your pilot realized he forgot the paperwork he needed for customs when what he landed... Forget about customs! How long have you been working around here? Don't you know that Alistair Crane does not deal with customs? Have you ever heard of a thing called a bribe? Uh, well, sir, international security... Well, I forget it! I want that plane off the ground now. Yes, sir. Get the hell out of here. Yes. Get the hell out of here. I want to take my Gwen to safety. Ashley, sweetheart, we're finally going. <laughs> 